Mitsubishi Storm L200 diesel engine 2.5cc. White smoke increases when fuel accelerator pedal is pressed. Problem solution greetings and congratulations from this channel SES Automotive. Hi guys today's car is Mitsubishi East Amel 200 the problem of the car is that after starting the car after pressing the oil a lot of white smoke is coming out exhaust pipe diesel engine what is the cause of white smoke and what is the reason in this video I will show you the details of why white smoke comes out then let's start what to do if your car has such a problem watch the full video then you will definitely understand inshallah Now I will start the car engine and press the oil accelerator pedal and see if white smoke comes out then let's see. I will start the engine of the car and there is no problem with the sound of the engine. Look for white smoke and engine oil coming from the exhaust pipe after starting the engine when press fuel accelerator pedal. See the engine oil is coming out of the exhaust, I hold it with my hand and show that only engine oil is coming. Now press the fuel accelerator pedal and see how much white smoke comes out. See a lot of white smoke coming out when you press the fuel accelerator pedal it is not possible to drive on the road with such smoke. See that a lot of common smoke comes out of the cause nothing can be seen behind the car, it is completely dark. Why do white smoke and engine oil come out together from the exhaust pipe of your car? What causes white smoke and engine oil after starting a Mitsubishi L200 diesel engine? There could be various reasons such as damaged piston rings or other cylinder worn exhaust or intake valve guides or valve seals. The most common reason could be yours turbocharger, since the turbocharger is oiled, the engine due to the turbocharger problem such problems, first open the turbocharger and check. First, check the car engine turbo. So open the engine turbo to check, so I open the car engine turbo, see a lot of engine oil in the exhaust pipe, the exhaust pipe is wet with oil. A turbo problem like this white smoke and engine oil coming out of the exhaust pipe so take the turbo off and check. Check that the exhaust pipe is completely wet as it leaks oil through the oil turbo changer. Note that the engine's exhaust fan is curved downwards and the turbo body is heavily eroded by fan rotation. Engine turbocharger leaking oil causing white smoke coming out of the exhaust pipe. Fresh air enters the inlet through the site turbocharger inside fan shop. The kit is damaged too much looseness causes the engine to leak oil. Turbo Chiger exhaust gas outlet engine oil leak The most common symptoms of a leaking turbo include a lack of power, random misfires, blue or black exhaust smoke, and peculiar noises. The blue and black exhaust smoke is the biggest indicator of an oil leak. I will show you how to open Turbo Chiger and repair change its repay kick. By opening the turbocharger I show you what's broken inside causing engine oil and white smoke. Rubochager shaft bush damages engine oil leak come out exhaust pipeline.
Now I will open Turbo Chidra Inlet Compressor Housing Remove the Lock Clip. Remove this lock clip open is true bochiger and lead housing. Check if your turbocharger's inlet air fan is broken against the housing. Broken turbocharger inlet fan causes less air to enter the engine, resulting in less engine power. The turbocharger is pretty much worn out so I will replace it and install a new turbocharger let's see. Engine oil enters a turbocharger through this top. A turbocharger engine oil enters the engine through this lower part. A turbocharger usually enters the engine oil on one side and returns the engine oil to the engine on the other side. Due to the damage of turbocharger's soft bushing and arring, when the engine oil pressure is under pressure, the oil leaks into the exhaust pipe at the place where the exhaust gas comes out, so the engine emits white smoke or black smoke and the engine oil decreases, the engine power decreases. Instead of repairing the turbocharger, I will replace it and install a new turbocharger. This is a new turbocharger. The old turbocharger is leaking so I will replace it with a new turbocharger. How do you install a new turbocharger? This fan and soft inside the normal turbocharger fit so that there is no problem of air entering the turbocharger and exhaust gas coming out. The new turbocharger will now be fitted with the Magnifol exhaust. When installing, tighten the screws properly so that the exhaust gas does not leak. Fit the turbocharger to the exhaust manifold nice and tight. <coughs> now fit the intake mains to the engine well and fit the water line in and outline well and fit the engine oil in and the engine oil outline well so that it does not leak. Put the intercooler and fit the out pipe well and fit the air pipes properly and fit the waste gate everything. When the turbocharger is fully installed, check the coolant, if the coolant is low, top it up, check the engine oil, if the engine oil is low, top it up. Now start the engine and see if the engine oil and white smoke comes out through the exhaust pipe. Inshallah now engine oil and white smoke is not coming out from exhaust pipe, remember engine oil and white smoke was coming out due to turbocharger problem, but now there is no problem of white smoke and engine oil leaking. After changing the turbocharger now the engine oil and white smoke is not coming out from the exhaust pipe and now there is no problem. If you like the video please subscribe this channel SES Automotive and click the bell button to get the next new video share the video and let your friends watch it. I pray that God keeps everyone well and healthy.